What is up guys? If you want to know how I did this beautiful half up half down hairstyle over my locks, make sure you stay tuned in for my video. Welcome back to my channel, Danielle Everything. This is a channel where I do DIYs, hair videos, I do wig reviews, I do product reviews, I do travel vlogs, just a little bit of everything. If you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for tuning in again to one of my videos. So today I am doing a hair video. So today I will be retwisting my hair and then doing a different style that I've never tried before. I'll be doing a half up, half down style. So, but before we get into this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Press the notification bell so you won't miss out on upcoming videos that I post. So let's get right into this video. So, all right, let's get into this hairstyle. So I'm going to be going over all the products I'll be using as well as the hair that I'm using to do this style. Like I said, I am doing half up, half down style. And I'll insert a picture, an inspiration picture to give you an idea. But I will be doing it on my locks here i'm going to retwist it and do individual braids and then i'm gonna put my headband wig on i'm gonna show you in a minute as the back part and then at the top part i'm gonna retwist my hair individually and put it up in a ponytail and then i'm gonna wrap it with some hair some wet and wavy hair so let me show you what i'm talking about so this will serve as the back of my um this will be in the back of my head so this will be the hair that I'll be using. This is the 24-inch headband wig. It's a wet and wavy um wig. I actually did a review on this wig um, uh, probably like at the beginning of my lock journey. And I also wore this wig in one of my birthday vlogs as well. So I will insert the links to those videos if you want to go back and watch those videos and see how um, well the hair held and all that. And then I went to my local beauty supply store and I found this um blended it's like blended human and synthetic hair and it's by bloom but it's bloom bundles wet and curly style it's uh made in beauty if i'm saying that word right made in beauty and it's uh bloom bloom bundle wet and curly style it's wet and curly and i got it in a color too and it's a 24 inch and it, and you can curl it and it's safe to curl up to 400 degrees um, I could have got human hair, but it made no sense because I'm not going to have this style in long. But it's good to know that I do have an alternative. You, you do have an alternative option if you don't want to spend a lot of money on, on real human hair. There's other options. You could get a synthetic blend. Like, you can get a human hair. You can get a synthetic human hair blend if you want a quick style for the week or two weeks or whatever the case of it is. And you don't want to spend a whole bunch of money. It's it's a budget. It's a game changer. And it's... um. It's budget friendly, so uh, you can wet it almost like the wet and wavy hair. So this will be my first time using it. I've never did this style before, so oh guys, I hope it turns out uh, good. But I'm gonna trust the process. Here I'm gonna be using product. I'm using to retwist my hair. As always, I always use the um, lock in. It lasts a long time. I use this. Um, I'm gonna you're gonna need a comb. A uh, spray bottle if you need to wet your hair if it's dry because I had already washed my hair uh, a few days ago so it's clean uh, and you're going to need a hair tie and some rubber bands and some um, hair pins because I'm not gluing the back I'm not gluing no hair in I'm not sewing no hair in I'm going to be pinning my hair in I'm pinning this hair into my head because it's not a permanent hairstyle i'm just i wanted to basically try this hairstyle out and then rock it for like a week or two and just do something different i want to switch it up so i'm going to be trying this hairstyle for you guys and you know if i like it this will be a, another go-to style that i will um be doing on my channel or just wear in general and also um if you feel that it's easy you can try it as well it's not a lot too it's just retwisting your hair and just placing placing the headband wig on the back of your head and wrapping the hair around your uh, ponytail. So I done done too much talking already. So the rest of this video, I'ma just basically show you guys the process of me doing my hair. It will be a voiceover. So I will be talking for the rest of the video. Then I'll come back at the end of the video 
and um, basically just show you how my hair came out. So let's get into it. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is separate my hair, which I already did. So I'm gonna be starting with the back of my head. So I'm spraying a little bit of water because my hair is dry because I had already washed it and moisturized it. So I'm going to basically be retwisting the back of my head first and then putting individual braids in the back of my head where the headband wig is gonna go. And then I must work on the front part of my head and twist those dreads individually and make sure I put that in a ponytail in the front. So that is what I'm gonna start doing now. Once I'm done retwisting my whole head, I'm going to go in with some extra lock in gel and do my edges and then put some foam on top of my hair. You can go on the dryer if you want to. It's optional, but I didn't. And then I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of my hair that's in the front into a ponytail. I like to use tangle free hair ties because they are much softer and they're not pulling on your hair. So now I'm going to take my headband wig and basically secure that in the back of my head with the four combs inside of the wig and as well as placing a barbie pin on each side of the back of my head to secure it even more. And this is how the wig looks once it is secure on the back of my head. 
And now I'm going to work on the front of my head by taking the bundle out the pack and brushing it a little bit to give it a little bit more volume. So I put some more hair ties in my lock ponytail to make sure that my locks weren't sticking out. And then the last step I did was basically place the barbie pin at the end of the track and then place the barbie pin and secured in the back of my ponytail and then started wrapping my hair with the bundles. Also, I took a piece from the ponytail and then wrapped that around the base of the ponytail. So, all right, guys, this is the end result. I'm loving it. It came out so pretty. It came out so nice. And it's something different, a different hairstyle that you can rock while having dreads. You don't always just have to get a regular um, hairstyle with dreads or always have to go to the salon and pay uh, 50 $40 just for a hairstyle. You can go at home and be creative and come up come up with different ideas for hairstyles that you can rock um, with weed. And I'm loving this hairstyle. So I must definitely be doing more videos with um, hair like this or straight hair or whatever just playing with stuff so just to to get ideas on how i could just still style my hair um in many different ways and if you have dreads i recommend you trying this hairstyle because it is cute um i'm probably not gonna keep it in that long i'll probably keep it in for a couple of days or whatever um I just want to do this video and show you guys that you can rock dreads many different ways and many different hairstyles. So guys, I hope you like this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Press the notification bell so you don't miss out on upcoming videos that I post. And I'll see you guys again on my next video.